What's up, everybody? Here with 1819 Revolution, PYT number 13. Good luck, guys. Contenders next, fellas. I'll line another filler then. Uh, during that contenders break, perhaps. Well, Jim, he just must not have liked you then. One, two, three left, four, five, six right. Left it is. Oh, Iverson gives zero shits about functions. I, I have uh, one environment meeting and two functions. Oscars and number of chips. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna go ahead and do this for Jay real quick. <laughs> oh, how are you gonna come back at that, Jay? <laughs> number of Oscars and number of chips. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Did not see, he did not see that coming. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was entertaining. Where's Jello says something funny? Jay Cowers with Tom Satch Sanders. Wait, Hori won seven? As I said, I thought Hori only had six championships. Pharrell's a cool cat, huh, Jim? Didn't Hori have three Rockets, three, La three Lakers? Or was it three Rockets, two Lakers, one Spurs? Was there two Spurs in there? Two Spurs. I will tell you guys the most Underrated greatest player of all time, Tim Duncan. Can't even touch it. Tim Duncan was a beast. And that dude does not get any love because he just was not flashy. I'm going to go ahead and go on Conley's side on this one. Uh, I don't really think that I mean, you can you can hang a zero in the Oscar department um, because we're talking about NBA. Yeah, well, I thought we were talking from like a financial set, uh, aspect earlier, Joel. And I, I don't know that Aiden is going to have the opportunity to win multiple NBA championships either. Timmy Two Steps was a beast. I love me, Mr. Fundamental. Dude, in, in terms of in my heart, Jim, Vince Carter is uh, top five. My favorite all-time NBA player. If you can jump over like a 7'6 international dude, 
and you leave your ball sack on the top of his head as you sail over him and dunk, you have instantly earned top five status in my uh, my my heart. Like Vince Carter, that dude is a phenomenal, phenomenal athlete. Yeah, Frederick Weiss. <laughs> you know what? It's been a while since I've watched that highlight. I'm gonna watch that today. And what I and the problem is when I bring it up, I watch it for like 37 straight minutes over and over again. I would very much uh, disagree with Jay Conley and say Kobe Bryant is far better than top 20. And I would very much disagree with Orange Jello and say uh, Kobe Bryant is not the best player of all time. And we have established that Vince Carter can jump over seven... Uh, seven foot six guys. This is what we've uh, come to the conclusion. Oh, you you can a hundred percent understand it. Orange Jello just likes to literally um, be argumentative. And we'll take any sliver of something where you can twist words and uh, twist words and throw that back at you. It's, it's literally not a, a Kobe debate by any means. It's literally a never-ending uh, entertainment stream for Orange Jello. That is how you truly understand the situation. It's nothing to do with Kobe. It has to do with personal entertainment and the love of debate. Orange Jello should have been a lawyer. Kobe was a great player, 100%. Carter, greatest dunker ever. I'll sign off on that. I can get behind that. That dude could dunk. Uh, Ghost, I have a contender's pool uh, next. That I'll probably line the filler while I start that break. So probably here in about maybe 20 minutes. Nice, Jim. I'm going to go with my top five favorite NBA players. Number one, Allen Iverson. Number two, Antonio Daniels. Number three, I'm probably going to go Vince Carter. Number four, Dr. J. Number five, let me think about five while I do this break. Oh, yeah, number five, Sean Kemp, definitely. God, we'll have Kemp back in the day. What's up, T-Boner? Dante Dizzle for the Bucks. Uh, Antonio Daniels uh, played ball here, uh, Jim, when I was in like 7th, 8th grade growing up. I went to all the games. Dude was a cool cat. Zaheer Smith. Marvin Bagley. DeMar DeRozan Impact. Miritic. Russell Westbrook. Zebo. DeAndre Jordan. Kawhi Leonard. Dennis Smith Jr. Trevor Ariza, Donovan Mitchell, uh, Robert Williams Impact. You like Gary Payton? I, I never really cared for uh, uh, Gary Payton. White Chocolate, well, Jay Will is sick. Least favorite of all, I don't like Larry Bird either. Kyle Kuzma. Kyle Kuzma, Jared Jackson Jr. to 100. I don't like Larry Bird either. I don't know. I don't know what it is about the guy. I just did not care for him. I didn't like Charles Barkley when he played either. But I love the guy. Charles Barkley is uh, the best uh, analyst in terms of entertainment value, bar none. Troy Brown, 
Musa. Wow. For your Chicago Bulls, Galactic Wendell Carter Jr. Nice hit, EC. Yeah, they did. Dikembe got him that one year, too, I think, in what, 94? 93, 94 season, maybe, when uh, the 8 seed Nuggets beat the uh, Sonics? I feel you on that, uh, Rich. That is a beautiful piece of paper. I concur. Vanderbilt. Oh, my. LeBron James for the Lakers. Oh, yeah. Michael Jordan would be my number five favorite. Oh, how the hell did I forget Jordan? Porzingis and John Wall. Bro, it might, it might be time to dust off that uh, Bowman love for a little revolution. You know what I'm saying? Maybe a little revolution love, perhaps. Clay Capella. It could happen. We can make that happen, Rojo. We can make that happen. Just throwing that out there. Bradley Beal, Brandon Ingram, Paul Millsap, White Howard, Mark Gasol, DeAndre Jordan, uh, Dennis Smith Jr., Diop, Donovan Mitchell. I don't mind D Rose. Um, I can't say I was ever like a massive fanboy of him. Lonzo Ball, Kevin Durant, Impact. Tatum and Mitchell Robinson. What's up, Kyle? Kyle? Aren't you, shouldn't be on the road yet? Tyreek Evans. Uh, Donald Mitchell and Terry and Prince Cubic. Enjoy your travels over to YouTube there, T-Bone. What's up, Four? Damn, look at everybody just coming out of, uh, coming out today. James Harden, Grayson Allen, Impact. Costas. Kevin Durant and James Harden. Damar D. Rosen. Kyle Kuzma. TJ Warren. Gotcha. Have a safe drive, Kyle. Townsend Ariza. Vujovic. I'm going to go Grant Hill. I think Grant Hill's ceiling was far, far greater than Derrick Rose's. CJ McCollum and Anthony Simmons. SGA for the Clippers. What What is everybody's opinion on that? Who had a far higher ceiling if they stay completely healthy? Grant Hill or Derrick Rose? Grant Hill was disgusting. Luca Astro. Obviously, you know where I stand. I mean, I don't mind Jason Kidd. I don't, I don't, I, he's not my top anything, though. Steph Curry, Markel Fultz. Chandler Hutchinson, Andrew Wiggins. Joe Robinson, Tyreek Evans. Paul George, James Harden, Impact. Giannis. Markanen and Shemet. Hey! Look at that, guys. That could have been a Luka. Instead, it is a Bagley in the Kings. You hate to get sick. I do too, man. That is probably one of my least favorite things to do is get sick. Uh, Trey Young. So I, I'm with you on that, my man. LeBron James and Marcus Aldridge. Really, Rojo. Anthony Davis impact liftoff. Little D-Rose sauce, huh? You, you are a Bulls homer, man. Damian Lillard and Huerta. Anthony Davis, Spud Webb, Kareem Barkley, and Rodman. Dude, Rodman was super entertaining. Super entertaining. I loved. There is nothing better to watch than Carl Malone and Dennis Rodman play against each other back in the day. You knew a shit show was going to ensue. <laughs> Depot and Eliakobo. Luca Astro again.
Blake Griffin, Lori Markanen, Chris Paul, Colin Sexton, and Ellie Acobo, and Reggie Jackson. And that was the break, guys. Thank you all. I appreciate it.